Hey, what's up guys? It's me, Cloud Gaming. I'm bringing you another video, and in today's video, I'm gonna be showing you guys the fastest way to level up in Modern Warfare, and that is by playing co-op. So, I'm gonna go ahead and show you guys the best guide to leveling up in Modern Warfare, and I will show you right now. So yes, you heard me right. This is the fastest way to level up in Modern Warfare. So, as you can see, I am already tier 7, and I did this with only about an hour of gameplay. So I started about here, and in about a game or two, I already had the screwdriver. And then I played one more game, and then I was already up to um, double XP tokens. So the best way to do this is by having a group of friends that you can actually get the... Um, the spec ops mission done with and you're going to be doing special operations and you're going to be doing this version of it so you can do really any of these but i would recommend the um headhunter because right now mo the most people on it are going to be on headhunter but it's done you could still probably do headhunter because it'll still probably have the most people on it so once you actually complete headhunter you will get a the new watch the um I think it is the sign of times yep and then once you also complete it you will get about a tier or two depending on how far you get and you will level up multiple times so I'm gonna go ahead and play I'll show you guys the end result of like as soon as we die I'll tell you about how we get and then I will show you how um how much XP I get so let's go ahead and get into it Okay, so that was a pretty quick game. That was about 11 minutes worth of gameplay, and I I got five levels from that. I was level 62, so I got five levels from that, and a tier, and then I didn't get that much because I didn't actually do that much, but that was 11 minutes of gameplay, and I got a tier. Or, yeah, about half a tier. Whereas if you go to something like, say, multiplayer, you get a tier for every 15, 16 games you play, each being 10 minutes, 
at the most, and then I'd say about five minutes at the least. So even if it's the least amount of time, you're getting about one tier for every 75 minutes. For for Warzone, it's a little faster than it is in um, than it is in multiplayer, but not much. But since it is a time and XP based game mode, or since it is a time and XP based um, battle pass this year. We have the time of being in Spec Ops, plus the XP of being in Spec Ops. So for a revive, you get XP. It doesn't tell you you get XP, but you get XP. For getting a crate, you get XP. It doesn't tell you you get XP, but you get XP. For getting kills, you get anywhere from 10 to 35 XP per kill. And you're killing on average, I don't know, I only killed... 31 um, enemies that game and I wasn't even there for most of the game I got there like three quarters to their game for getting uh, revives you also get XP and you keep your XP even when you die um, and then if you die and then retry the mission you have a checkpoint and it keeps that XP so you can play completely through the mission even dying a couple of times and you get to keep all of that XP which is why spec ops is the best mode to get XP because you have the time factor because it could take anywhere from 11 minutes to actually it probably couldn't take it could take anywhere from 30 minutes to multiple hours with how difficult it gets at times you have the XP factor because every time you kill some uh, an enemy you get anywhere from 10 to 30 XP plus you can use double XP to double the XP you also have the time factor because it could take a while you have the you have the um, roll um, factor which if you use the um, if you use engineer I think you get a little XP I don't know how much XP you get from the um, stopping power because I don't know if it counts you get X you get extra XP for using the demolitionist you get um, I think you get XP per ping with the recon I think you get uh, heavy yeah because you get armor you get XP for um, you get XP for giving them ar armor um, and then you have more armor or you have more ammo you have a hundred percent more ammo in launchers so you get one extra bullet in the launchers um, and all of these have uh, passive abilities this one has better accuracy this one has um you can pick up the grenades from enemies this one has a faster reload and this one has extra damage to armor targets and vehicles so not only do all of these have their own little perks but you get xp for using each one of these um if you're going to use one i would use either recon medic or um armor i would think that you should use recon more um, because it is a fast load, and then I think you get XP per enemy you ping, and in, um, in Spec Ops, that's a lot of XP, but here's my class, um, because for this, it has these modifiers on, which is plated, so bullets bounce off enemies, um, you can get grenades off of enemies you kill, and then you get free rocket launcher ammo for every rocket launcher you shoot. So what you're going to want to do is you're going to want to get either an explosive ammo gun like the um, the Rytec and you're going to want to put explosive ammo or incendiary ammo or on the um, crossbow you can do the same thing. But what I run is either that explosive Rytec with a sight or I run this. I run um, all these attachments. with dragon's breath on the model and then i have the screwdriver because it's a one hit kill really any melee weapons a one hit kill if you're going to use one um i would recommend the dual um the dual karachis because they are a one hit kill and they have more lunge um i think i should switch out this for stim texas just because those are better and then i have eod hardline and amped um, I'll probably take off hardline 
and what I can do is I can put on high alert and I can take off amped and I can put on battle hardened um, that way things don't affect me if they throw um, grenades or stuns or anything um, actually that would probably be better with that this way I get more um, I get more lethals that can recharge um, I then also have the stem so this is my class for this modified version of um, this is my class for the modified version of spec ops which is the fastest way to level up in modern warfare I hope you guys enjoy if you did please like button and subscribing I upload every day whether it be modern warfare Mortal Kombat or the Spartan podcast I'll see you guys in the next video and goodbye